Now, the Federal Airport Authority of Nigeria says the reported fire outbreak at the old terminal of the Mutala Mohammed International Airport, Lagos, was blown out of proportion on social media. TVC News' Ayomidia Jigwe reports that FAN has now relocated to the new terminal. The report. I want two or three major maintenance issues. When the Minister for Aviation, Festus Kayamo, visited both the local and international wing of the Murutala Mohammed Airport last week, he gave quick notices, standing orders and ultimatums which sent signals to both airline operators and airport agencies to fasten their seatbelt for the long ride ahead. Just barely a week after his visit, a fire outbreak was reported at the Terminal 1 of the MMIA, which, according to the airport manager, was from the basement, even though unusual. The whole thing emanated from the battery bank of the UPS. Uh, what could have caused the battery to explode is uh, what we are still trying to, to know, because these batteries actually were new. We bought them just about three months ago, and the expiring date is supposed to be for five years. So basically, the batteries are they are good. So what could why, what could have triggered the whole thing is what definitely we we will we look into. What will interest anyone though is if there is a deliberate attempt to sabotage the effort of the new minister and the Federal Airport Authority, which the managing director says investigation are still ongoing. A society where there is so much uh, distrust, it's very easy to think of sabotage and considering the fact that also in the most recent months the airport itself has been uh, having one issue after another so it's easy to think about that but one cannot jump into any conclusion without investigating it. He further spoke of the ultimatum issued by the minister on the relocation from the old terminal to the new terminal and the evacuation of grounded aircraft. We've already started the process of re-informing them. It's not that they are not aware. And in fact, the location where you saw those aircraft, it's officially a graveyard meant for those kind of aircraft. But you can't have an airport littered with such. Already, the new terminal is coming alive with activities and it's expected to be so for a long time. At the international airport, everything is possible. Traveling can be made easy with effort by both government and agencies in charge. Ayomidia Jigbe, TVC News, Lagos.